Hey everybody, so today Apple released iOS 11.3 Beta 2, and in this video we're going to be talking about the new battery features that they added. Now there were a couple of other features they added in this update, but in here we're just going to be talking about the battery features. So if we jump into our settings and then scroll to battery, you'll see this new battery health section, and it is in beta right now as you can see. So these features here are going to be available for the iPhone 6 and later, so not the 5S unfortunately, and um, not the iPads or iPod Touches either. Um, so just iPhones and 6 and later. Um, so in here you can see the maximum capacity of your battery, so this one's still at 100%, yay. Um, it says this is a measure of battery capacity relative to when it was new. Lower capacity may result in fewer hours of usage between charges. And then we also have this peak performance capability, so it will give a little description of how your battery is doing underneath that. So it says your battery is currently supporting normal peak performance. Um, sometimes, like if you just experience an unexpected shutdown, it will report that here. And it will also tell you if your battery needs to be replaced. So, yeah, these are the features that Apple talked about on their website. Um, some of them, they also talked about this f thing where you could, like, turn off the feature where it's basically slowing down your phone to get better battery life. They have not added that in this beta, but they will in another future one. Um, and though that feature will be available for the iPhone 6 through 7, so just not the, new the newest 8 and 10 models. So, yeah. Also, um... They didn't release this specific beta for the iPod Touch 6 generation. Um, I have an iPod Touch 6 generation, that in which I'm recording with. Um, they didn't actually release this beta for that device, which is really weird. Um, it's the only device they excluded, so I'm not sure why that is. But they say that it will be receiving that update in the future, so I'm not sure if they mean it's going to get the beta 2 update or if it's just going to skip over that one and go to beta 3. But yeah, that was really interesting, so I don't know if they're like working on something for it. Um, the battery life on the iPod Touch 6th generation on iOS 11 has been really bad, like really, really bad. Um, it was never good to begin with in like iOS 10, but iOS 11 was even worse. Like, I kid you not, it lasts maybe like an hour, like maybe, on a charge, so it's not good. But um, yeah, those are just the new battery health features in iOS 11.3. If you want to see more of the features in iOS 11.3 Beta 1, you can go watch my other video, and the card will be right here. So yeah, make sure to watch that, and that's it for this video. Peace.